This is the new version of Erasmus Studio and I'm logged in and I'm going to start by creating a new aura. I'm going to load my trigger image and I'm going to give it a name defined later. Now this is just the still image that you'll be seeing. So I'm going to grab my JPEG and save it. Now I'm going to X out of that, click Next. Now I'm going to add my overlay. The overlay is usually a video, the thing that will pop up on the iPad when it's been triggered. So depending on how big your file is, it may take two, three minutes for it to upload. Okay, so once that has been added, I can rearrange where I want the video to load. I can also resize it. Uh, but for these purposes, I'm just going to keep it as is, and I'm going to click the Next button. And I'm going to give my aura a name. So, so I can find it later. I'm calling it Penny Portrait. I'm going to click Save, and I've created it. Okay, so now I'm going to close that and you can see that my hour has been created. I'm going to go to my account, click my account, and now what I want to do is I want to click on share your private campaign and this gives you a special web address. This is what you use to go in and connect your iPad to this particular channel. Um, you can use a QR code, create a QR code out of that, and so it's easy for the iPads to connect or just use Safari to connect and type in the web address. So now you would open the Erasma app and hover the iPad over it and this is what will happen. So now if you want to try this yourself, you can go ahead and link right now to this URL address or use a QR code and try it.